Holography was invented in 1947 by Denis Gabor, who in 1971 was awarded the Nobel Prize for his work. Whereas before, microscopy afforded only an image of variations of intensity, as with a photograph, Gabor's invention made it possible to record not only intensity, but also light's phase, and thus recreate a full 3D image. In conventional microscopy, the object is lit by a conventional light source and enlarged by a lens system. The image shows only contrasts in intensity. No accurate 3D or vertical measurement is possible. In holographic microscopy, the beam from a coherent light source, or laser, is split into two beams, one illuminating the object itself and the other providing a reference beam which, when recombined with the other beam, creates a phase interference that is registered onto the hologram plate. To retrieve the object, the plate is lit by a coherent light beam identical to the reference beam used at the recording of the hologram. It permits 3D viewing of the original object exactly as registered, with all optical information retrieved in full, but no topographical or vertical measurements are yet possible. Until after more than 10 years' research at the Swiss Federal Institute of Technology using the same phase interference, scientists registered the holographic image in a digital camera, which then feeds the information into a computer program. The numerical reconstruction process permits immediate quantitative access to intensity and phase. Topographic measurements accurate down to the nanometric scale and an immediate real-time follow-up surveillance of the sample evolution. Lincitech is proud to be the first to market a microscope exploiting Gabor's innovative work to the fullest extent yet achieved.